Hi, it's Mrs Blake from Manorside and um, we've had some feedback from reception year one and year two parents and carers to say that you'd like to be able to upload more than one picture at a time to your to-dos. Um, so there is a way around that but it will mean just a couple of changes to what you find in your to-dos. So I'm just going to log in as a child so that you can see what you need to do. Now these changes um, will be uh, starting from the week beginning the 18th of January. Um, some to-dos have already been set up though for the next week, so not all of your to-dos will be on this new format, um, but they moving forwards, each new to-do that is set by the teachers will look like this. So to find your work, go to your alert section, and I've set up a to-do to show you how to upload work in the new way, so I'm going to go to that. And you'll see you get a screen that's very similar to the screen that we were using before. Um, along the top, you've got some extra options though. Before we only had the picture of the mountain. Um, now there's some additional functions. You don't need to worry about those additional functions apart from the camera. So the mountain and the camera are going to be really useful for you. And then just below that, there's uh, these boxes labeled one to four white boxes. They're like your fresh pages. So each one of those can take a new photograph. If for whatever reason you needed more pages than are already set in, you can press the purple add sign and it will add additional pages for you. Okay, so I'm going to click back to my page one and just like I did uh, previously, I'm going to select the, the mountain picture. Now this is really useful, particularly if you are using a laptop or a desktop device. Um, so you're going to need to press choose file and select an image and press open. Now, if you go in through the mountains, uh, you'll get your option to edit the photo and press OK. And you'll also get this option then as to whether you want your photo to be on all frames or just this frame. And we want it to be on just this frame, so just that first page. So you need to select the second option and press OK, and it will insert the picture. And then you can move on to page two and do the same thing. So click into your mountain and insert your picture. However, if you're using a phone or a tablet to upload the work to Purple Mash, the, the icon next to the mountains, the icon of the camera, will be really, really helpful. So you can just take the photo straight away and import it into this document. So if I click on the camera button instead, I can take picture number one of my maths and use that photo and it will go in. I can then select frame three and select the camera again. And I'm gonna take photo number two of my maths and use that photo and then select frame four, press on the camera button again and take the photo. And I can use that photo for myself. Um, and then that's all you need to do. So the other buttons you don't need to worry about. They, um, If they were being used in a computing lesson, we would be turning this um, selection of images into a film. Obviously, you don't need to do that right now. Um, so once you've uploaded all your images to that document, click on the red backwards arrow. Make sure you press save and exit, just like you were doing beforehand. And then that will upload to your child's to-do. And so the teacher can mark it. Okay, so hopefully that will help and um, enable you to share your children's learning much more easily with us.